how to paint clouds, but on mirrors. Get a mirror, clean it. Choose a background color, paint on. So start from the outside and then pull in. Once you get the shape you want, leave it to dry. I suggest a second layer, but if you don't want to, that's cool too. I have no patience, so I actually dry it with that. Once it's dry, you need titanium white in the background color. Make a really dark shade and a really light shade. Use the light color to draw the shape of the top of the cloud. Then use the darker shade to blend it in. Add highlights. Just keep blending until everything looks like smooth and nice. Add the background color at the bottom. Just keep going back and forth with the colors until you get a really nice cloud. Do different sizes and shapes. I wanted a pom-pom mirror for my daughter's room, but whoa, those things are not cheap. I decided to upcycle a mirror I already had. I started with two rows and quickly realized I probably needed three rows to give it some volume. This is how it turned out. Make sure to follow to see more of my upcycling DIYs. So I really wanted an Amazon. So I recently got this mirror from Target and I wanted to elevate its look and make it look more so like the anthropology mirror, so let's make it happen. Here are all the materials I used that I got from Hobby Lobby or Amazon. And you're going to take that wooden applique and cut it in half and tape down the borders. Then I sanded down any rough edges and applied the Gorilla Glue on the border of the mirror and clamped the pleaks down to the mirror for one to two hours. Then I'll be applying the pearl stickers onto the remaining border space. Next I sprayed the metal leaf adhesive and then laid down the gold leaf sheets. Then using a dry brush, you're just going to pat down the gold leaf and brush away. Lastly, use the metal leaf spray sealer and you're done. I don't need your glitter, I just need a will to start. Numbing through prescriptions, isolate. You guys, the other day when I was driving along, I saw this garage sale that had this amazing mirror, and after some master negotiating, the mirror is 15. How about 10? 15. Deal.
I got the mirror. I wanted to start by spray painting the mirror, so I covered the glass in newspaper and tape to keep protected and then lay down a tarp so I could begin spray painting. I wanted the mirror to be white with gold accents, so I started by taking white spray paint and coating the entire frame, and I did it in about like two or three coats. Then I went in with a spray adhesive and some gold flakes to add in the gold accent. And after a few hours of doing this, it was all done, so I just took off the covering and it was finished. Told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, As you fade away before I throw anything away, I try to think of ways to reuse it. These old plates had been sitting in my cabinet for months, so I finally decided to turn them into cute little mirrors. I spray painted them gold and painted on some eyes. Not too bad for some trash. 